Leave. Soon dare? Maybe. Soon dare. Can't leave. Yum! Corner, you gotta try some poi. Okay. Do it in one gulp! <laughs> wow. Luca! Gosh! I think Luca might be a little drunk. <laughs> Corner, you try? Special Jurassic Pork Soup. <laughs> oh, you killed me with the joke. Jurassic pork. That's hilarious. Ayla fight reptites. Ala, very smart. All in Ioka village fight. No fight? Go to Laruba village. Don't know where village is. Always hide. Azala want to destroy Ayoka and Laruba. But Ayla no lose. When they only when Ayla dead give up. Enough. Meet Chrono today. Good day. Eat party. Sing pants. Are you enjoying yourself a little bit more now, Robo? What an unpleasant substance! And so many bugs in it! <laughs> Freaking out! <laughs> I'm good, thanks. Okay, <laughs> you convinced me. Delicious. Chrono, you look for Red Rock? Yes. A red, red Rock sign of power. Ayla, strongest Ioka village. So, Ayla's rock. You want rock, you challenge Ayla. You win, then Ayla give to you. Challenge Ayla? Hell yes, I can take you. Bring plenty soup! What? Party now, so eat. <laughs> Chrono and Ayla have soup race! I trained for this! We trained for this at the, uh, at the fair, remember? It's one of those. We start now. Push A button much times. Got it. That's a lot easier than getting eight eight cans at the eight cans of soda at the Millennial Fair. That one's a lot less challenging. You don't have to go as fast. Maybe eat too much. <laughs> oh, world <laughs> hungover. Are there paw prints everywhere? Good morning. That soup seems to affect humans. <laughs> Phew. What, liar? I was a perfect lady last night. Why does my tummy hurt so? Poor Luca. Uh, Luca <laughs> just shakes her head. Like, oh, all my friends are hungover. It's gone. The gate key's been taken. Oh, crap. These prints were left by the thief. Without it, we're stuck here forever. This isn't funny. Let's go see Ayla. <laughs> Snort. <sighs> Hello. Our gate key was taken. You don't know what that is. Chrono, you up already? Too much soup. Sorry to wake you, but we've been robbed. Must be reptites. Corner, come with Ayla. We settled the re with reptites. Who else come? Hmm. Okay. Do you guys know which one would be best to bring? Hmm. I have to bring Chrono and Ayla. I guess I should bring either Robo or Marl, so I have a healer.
You have to bring Ayla because of that outfit. <laughs> I really, need, I really need to have a healer with me, I think. At least somebody with a healing ability. So either Marl or Roba. Robo. Marl is kind of like not outfitted though, is she? We'll just we'll just stick with Robo. Okay. This will be an interesting party. Someone from Village C. We go ask. I get more of that soup? <laughs> Nyoka Hut. Thunder stun all dinosaur! What do you have? Fang, petal, horn, feather. Bring three each of any two. I give you one weapon. Wow. When rain, rare monster appear. Trade your shiny stone? Oh, they don't have anything complicated here, do they? Man. I don't know what Ayla has on, but whatever it is, it's better than an iron helm. And so we got a new party member, Ayla! I, don't know, I, forget, I forget if she's with us permanently now or not. I don't think so. Not yet. Oh, you're right, Vanu dude. I don't know how you went back. I don't know how she went back to the end of time now. Okay, so Ayla doesn't really learn any uh, like magical abilities. I don't. She just has the MP to use like techs. Uh, but Ayla fights with her bare hands, so she also doesn't need weapons. See her fist? You can't swap out for this. She has a rock helm, a ruby vest, and a power scarf. What does a power scarf do? Uh, it increases her power and her attack damage. Nice. Oh, I have nothing else that she can even equip. Okay. Where are we supposed to be going now? <laughs> I need to get some directions. Come from meeting south. Went sight. Oh, okay, went south to the forest maze. Got it. That be this. Yes. Let me actually. Footsteps. Follow. Oh. Yeah. But can we not put the berserk on Ayla? That's a good idea. She looks like Android 18. Yeah, again, all the, 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 the guy who did the com the concept art and all the in-game drawings is the same guy who did the original animation for Dragon Ball Z. That's why that's why they all look kinda like like Trunks and uh, Android 18 and then Bulma. I think Luca's the only one who doesn't look like a Dragon Ball Z character. Uh Oh, I already saved my game. Yeah, now let's see if we can't put the Berserker on her. Auto attack. And she doesn't have magic, so it's probably a good idea. Because it does, like, great stuff, doesn't it? The Berserker? Let me remind myself what it does. Oh, and we have some Dreamstone. Oh, yeah, we won it, but we can't go back to use it to repair the sword until uh, we have our gate key. Auto attack, hit, and defense up. Nice. Alright, here we go. So now Ayla will just handle herself. We'll see if I like this or not. Kino, what you do? Say now! <laughs> Ayla take Chrono stuff. Why take? Kino like Ayla best. Ayla like Chrono, but Kino not like. That feel when no girlfriend. <laughs> Miss Ayla, please do not promote violence. Kino, you know why I punish? Ayla no like Kino. No, Ayla like Kino best. No more do bad stuff, okay? That wrong. I feel like I'm losing brain cells reading this dialogue. I mean, it makes sense for the character, but it's like, damn. Ah. Sorry, Chrono. 
Give back stuff to Chrono. No have. Lost reptile. <laughs> Reptite's sake. I knew he was going to say, no have. <laughs> Reptite. <laughs> now she's back on it. Run into the trees. Uh, Kino Perfect Village. Got it. Uh, Kino is banned, so if Ayla died, Kino chief then. I'm not exactly sure if... I guess they're like a couple. That's the best I can figure out of it. What is this? <laughs> it's a chest. That's funny. Oh! Birds. Ancient birds. It's an Archaeopteryx! No, not quite. Ayla! Kicking ass. Berserking over there. She turned red. Is that, what the, is that the Berserker doing that? Ayla's pretty fast, too, it seems. The gold eaglet turned red, too. I don't understand. What the heck? Dude, Ayla doing a lot of damage. Let me check, um... What is Ayla's speed? 13? Yeah, she's even faster than Chrono. Dude. It was kind of like an underrated character, I think, in this game, in terms of real like usefulness, because she doesn't have any magic. But you know, um, <laughs> these guys don't really seem dangerous. They look so fuzzy and friendly, you know. And the ones in our time just just like to admire the mountains. It seems like your fastest person automatically gets their turn at the beginning of battle. Wow, Ayla, you're scaring me. You're scaring me, girl. Ayla learns kiss. So Ayla's kiss ability. I'm trying to remember what that does for her. It's HP sum and status restored. Oh, cool. So it's like a restoration ability. That's kind of cool. Hang on, let me try using that. Ah, nice. Uh, well, you know what? We could have taken Luca with us then, couldn't we? Not a big deal. Hmm. Oh, so many questions to answer. Alright. Got one meat eater. I'm trying to figure out who my final party will be that I'll, like, stick with to the end of the game, but I don't know. You can always swap out at any time, but... Whoa, something big coming out there. Winged ape. Oh, is that a crit? Ayla, kicking ass. Oh, he threw... Chrono into Robo. He threw Robo... Yeah, he threw Chrono into Robo and did damage to Robo. Weird. Got a fang. Okay. We're picking up these little items. I don't know exactly what they're going to end up being good for. But it has to be something here, right? Yeah. All these footprints, man. The only thing with Ayla going berserk is that I can't choose who she's attacking when the battle starts. Well, most of the time it doesn't matter, because she's kicking ass wherever she goes. Is she supposed to be turning red like that? That's a question I have. Out of shelter. <laughs> Ayla has a wicked sunburn. I wonder if that's indicative of her, like, berserk status. I missed an item back there. It's indicative of berserk? Cool. That's what I would guess. But then there was... those birds were turning berserk in that other fight. 
Or they were turning red, at least. I don't know what that meant. I say, where's the fight trigger? Alright. <laughs> These are the guys that are resistant to physical damage. It's weird how like the whole area gets lit up by that. I think you guys just need to stop asking so many questions about how the stuff works. I don't care if the KISS ability works on robots. Mm, you know. What's it matter? Ooh, hello. Yeah, call in your friends. I know what you're doing. I have so long putting my inputs in that Ayla's just like, I'll take care of it. <laughs> That's funny. Gotta heal. That's the end of the road over here. Damn, there's a dive bombing bird there for seven damage. Do they turn red when they're like about to die or something? Or they're changing to like their second form? I don't even know. I sometimes forget that the memory cursor does not. Stick. Oh, critical. On which enemy you chose to attack. Yeah, with Ayla and Chrono together in the party, it's a lot of physical attacks and not a whole lot of damage going, or not a whole lot of magical attacks going around. So they definitely leave you vulnerable to certain enemies, I think. So follow on these footprints, man. <sighs> Poncho, I thought you liked tribal women, as shown by walking waking cloud. Well, you know. Waking Cloud, it wasn't because it wasn't because she was tribal that I liked her. Who is the de facto mage in this game? Right now, it would be it would be Moral. Reptite layer. Actually, let's, uh. Yeah.
Alright, here goes. Gotta take out some reptites. What are these dudes? Have we seen these before? They look familiar. He's freaking out, dude. Let me just drill him underground. Alright. Sounds like a door. Nope. Well, oh, there's some dudes in this layer. Oh, we're going down the hole. Oh my. <laughs> Interesting. Evil weevils. Man, by the time Rebel gets to do his laser spin, usually we've already taken out some of the enemies. It'd be a good thing to do first, because it hits everyone. Yeah, I guess Luca's also like a magic-based character. But I think of her as almost like a techie that happens to have like the magical ability as well, you know? Oh, I'm definitely fighting you. You look cool. Megasaur. <laughs> Alright. I'm sensing this is be a time to use lightning. Ooh, he's tough. A lot of damage there. Defensive to power. Oh, it decreases when shocked. Nice. Yeah, look at how much damage that did. Nice. No, a hole suddenly reappears. <laughs> it's an obese gibble! <laughs> Not quite. There's some reptites. Hey, sickos, let's do it. It was just like, fuck you! Aegla's <laughs> getting in there, kicking ass before I even have a chance to use my moves. This berserker is awesome, man. Oh, I wasn't fast enough. For some reason I thought that the cyclone would kill. I gotta say, nothing we've seen so far though, nothing we've seen so far has been as cool as Chrono's finishing move on the dragon tank. That was awesome, man. It just looked so cool. The sound effects was like, CHING! Whoops, wrong one. That might kill that Reptite, it doesn't matter. <laughs> no biggie. Dang, Ayla got her attack in before Chrono's lightning got off. That's too bad, because it would have done more damage after the lightning. There we go. Leveling up. We're like level 16 or 17 now. Full ether. I thought that was going to be my items, man. Oh, I did do like Waking Cloud. She's a cutie, what can I say? <laughs> she walks up and one-shots the mushroom. That's hilarious. You guys watched the Magic School Bus? Are you in high school or, or in college? If you're in college, that's freaking awesome. <laughs> Go nuts, Ayla. Okay. A little less exciting, then. You can get away with anything in high school. If you're watching the Magic School Bus in, uh... That didn't do anything to him. Man. 
Oh, he's throwing the other enemies at us! Dude! If you can get away with watching the Magic School Bus in uh, college, that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, the short road to my heart with massive DPS. Now she learns a Rolio kick. So we just learned some dual techs with her. Drill kick, spin kick. With, with Chrono and Robo. So basically, um, now we have to take the Berserker off her if we want to start using those moves. Which might be a good idea, honestly. A physical attack? That's her and Chrono working together? Or her and Robo, for that matter. Could, could kick a lot of ass. So I'm going to take the Berserker off of her in just for a minute, just to see if, what those techs look like. How low are we on health? Tom and Jerry. How the heck does that make any sense? We still haven't used Max Cyclone, have we? I don't think we've used Max Cyclone. <laughs> Combo, Rollo, Kick. That's the one with Robo. No, oh, no, that's her own thing. Nice. Let's see what spin kick looks like. 232, not bad. Ayla is like twice as fast as Robo, man. shooting fire. He's shooting his lasers! Critical! Hello. Save point. Cluing me in that I probably want to save up and use a shelter. goes. What are we fighting here? What's this? How could those could those apes have made something this advanced? Zala! Ah, the apes have arrived. Hmm, you're nothing like Ayla. Tell me what this is at once. Tell Zala about the key. Um... Uh... Um, uh, I, uh, 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 I'm not gonna tell her. Balls to you. I guess you need some motivation. Come, Nisbel! What? Oh no. That, that dude, that Triceratops is ripped! <laughs> power decreases when shocked. Good, that's what I was hoping for. 516, nice. Now I'm gonna do the dual, do the dual tech with uh, the two of them. Drill kick. Basically we're just, we're both Chrono and uh, Robo are taking turns throwing Ayla at the enemy. <laughs> That's my strategy for this battle. 
releases electrocution energy. Oh my god. Oh, that did a hell of a lot. Robo, you're officially on healing duty. The other two are going to be attacking. Seventeen. Oh, he needs another shock. Okay. Uh, shite. Curbeam Ayla. No, 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 no. Lightning. Okay. Rollo kick. Doo -doo. Oh, not too bad, actually. Oops, I healed the wrong person. Shit. I'm gonna use one of Ayla's turns to heal Chrono. Oh, and Robo goes down. Crap. Oh, damn! That didn't do much. He, needs my, he must need another lightning bolt. Alright, now Ayla's gonna attack and Chrono is gonna heal Robo. Shit, shit, heal him, heal him, heal him, heal him! God damn it! Fuck! This is not good. This ain't good, guys. Oh, we're done. Not easy. Not easy. Like I said, that Triceratops is ripped! Okay, so it looks like the worst thing it does is releases the electrocution energy that um, hits everybody for like 150. I gotta remember that that happens. After this, after this bit, we're gonna go back to Mario, I think. Alright, let's try this again. Did I, um... Yeah, well, no, wait. I did, I did not heal. Let me... <laughs> okay. Hmm. Maybe I can do my strategy a little better this time. Keep Chrono on. Put Chrono on lightning duty, and then we'll hit him like twice. And then if anybody's below 200, we'll heal them. Okay. Actually, I want to find out what happens if you tell her about the gate key. Liars! No one would talk that easily. This should loosen your tongues. Oh. So no matter what you do, she doesn't believe you. Good lord. <laughs> I, guess I can't stop saying it. That Triceratops is ripped. I think they're actually better off doing separate attacks than doing the same 
attack together. Okay. So now we take a healing turn. Alright, so on this turn... She kisses herself, which is funny. He uses lightning again. Cure Beam goes across the Chrono. So now on the next turn, Ayla is going to kiss Robo, and Chrono is going to attack. Alright, now we'll do a dual tech. I want to see this max cyclone. 470? Okay. Alright, Ayla needs healing. Ayla, you gonna kiss yourself, girl! Ooh, dangerous. We need to heal Chrono and Ayla again on the next cycle. somebody. He's at the lowest health. Robo? Okay, then we're gonna Cure Beam. Cross to Chrono. Lightning over here. Kiss herself. Alright, we're getting it now, guys. We're hanging in with this guy. Oh crap! She he got Robo. Shit. Mm -mm, this isn't good. Oh boy! Oh boy! All right. Like this. Chrono might die if he releases electrocution energy on this turn. Which would be bad because we need Chrono for the lightning. Shit! See how much damage it does without lightning first. 16! Oh, that's like nothing! Oh no. Shit. I couldn't get my inputs in fast enough to save Robo. God damn it, and I wasted a turn, apparently.
Don't use lightning until you're healed, then he won't use the electrocution attack. That makes sense. Right, I'm gonna try and do it with Cro just Chrono and Ayla. Are we out of mana? Yes, we are. Alright, we're gonna take some time to heal up here. Oh boy. God damn it, I couldn't get the inputs in fast enough. Oh, Chrono still arrives with 2 HP! Dude! Now I have a good situation again. Now we're back in this. Dude, we were so close to getting him when he started killing everybody, and then we had stalled out and heal everyone. I could have done that fight better, I think, if I had managed my healing a little more. No level ups. Oh, surprising. All right, Azala, you drop that gate key. Your days are numbered. I did not detect any damage. Fight anytime, Azala! <laughs> Burp. What? What's wrong with her? You leave, Krona? No fun for Ayla. Thanks, for, thanks, Ayla. I learned a lot from you. Hmm. <laughs> ah, uh, Kino apologizes to us. Come again, Krono. Party, eat, fight, fun. Hmm. <laughs> yes. Robo and Luca, too. Okay. We will come again. Alright, so we got the redstone we needed to repair the sword. Yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm getting past that. Well, that dinosaur on the uh, seriously ripped Triceratops was probably the hardest boss so far. So trying to manage that electrocution attack was uh, tricky. Oh, my butt's falling asleep. I guess I gotta get a pillow or something to sit on. That boss didn't give that very much experience. Like, those enemies we just fought gave us 180. The boss only gave us 500. Felt kind of ripped off. Nah, back to the gate we go.
What, is this like a portal? Are we gonna come out the other side of the gate, falling really fast? That would be funny as hell. The Masamune! Next time on Let's Stream Chrono Trigger, we're gonna head back to 1000 AD, and uh, with the broken sword and the stone we need to repair it, we're gonna repair the Masamune. Oh yeah! Ugh. Next time on Let's Stream Chrono Trigger.